everybody. We're live right here for the first Jack Yates annual all-class picnic right here at 4149 Players, right here out the corner of Players and Harlem Clark. I got Miss Patrice along with my other young lady. Let us know what we're doing today, Patrice, and what time are we going to end this thing? Will Jack Yates do it? Will Jack Yates bring third ward to Harlem Clark? Hey, guys, we are here at BH Ranch. We are here to do our second day of our Tribe of Lions Alumni Weekend. We starting at 12, we ending at 8, so come on out. We have a moonwalk, we have food trucks, we have DJ battle coming up at 4 o'clock, and we're going to have the alumni class roll call, so you got to come out and show us what class you're repping. All right, and what's your name, young lady? My name is Ivy Hicks-Taylor. I'm with the class of 1985, and, I, and I'm, I'm challenging all classes. We want to see who has the most alumni out today. So 85, I'm challenging you and all the other class members to come out and have a great time for this first annual alumni reunion. Let's make it epic. Let's go, Lions! All right, everybody, we're coming to you live right here in Harlem Clark and Jack Yates' first annual all-class picnic, and I got some of the people who are responsible for finally getting us an all-class picnic, and I'm going to let them introduce themselves. Hi, I'm Catrice Thomas, uh, class of 90. I'm DJ Frank, class of 81. Okay, let me ask you guys this. When, you, when we started this, we knew it was going to be a hard battle trying to get everybody together. But the thing about it, we made an effort to start. And everything has a beginning. And I am so proud of being a Jack Gates class of 1967 from the old school of Jack Gates when they were segregated. To see that the young people such as yourself have came together and tried, put an effort to make an all-class picnic. And I want to say on the behalf of all the people in the 60s and the fabulous 50s, we thank you because we knew it was going to be a hard battle, you know, and I don't want you young people to feel like, hey, man, why do we have to fight among each other the way we do? But this is something, Patrice, that we inherit this, believe this or not. Okay. And nobody, everybody know that I do history. Okay. And we inherit this right. from 2016 Elgin. Wow. So you see, this this go back deep, right. but the cycle got to be broke, right. and I recommend and I'm all praises for you guys to try to break the cycle. Thank you, thank you. And tell us what are we trying to do out here today, out here in Harlem Clark? Uh, well, today is the second day um, of the weekend. The, we're calling it the Tribe of Lions mm -hmm. weekend. Um, yesterday we did the mixer, so today was the final day for all classes who could not come out last night. And this will be the final day to network, fellowship, bond with alumni you probably just talked to on Facebook. And now you actually can put a face with the name that you see. And this is the foundation that we wanted to create for years to come. So next year, because we've only did this and put all this together in three weeks, three short weeks. Three weeks? Three weeks. Three weeks. Yeah. Man, I recommend y'all did a hell of a job. <laughs> Thank you. Thank y'all. Y'all did so a hell of a job. So hopefully next year we can actually start this and have this around homecoming weekend. So it'll be better planned. We'll have more time. And then, you know, we can move forward and it can be a yearly successful event. Okay, now, Patrice, now I noticed that we're having it out here in Harlem Clark, and I'm so proud <laughs> right. of this, Patrice, because right. a lot of DNA from Harlem Clark and Madison, they come from Jack Yates. Right, right, right. And to see them come in and y'all come out here mm -hmm. to host this very special event, right. it's a, a privilege to be part of this. Right. And I, and, and I say this on the behalf of the the Roaring Sixties and the Fifties. Okay. And and it's good that y'all have decided to do this and make an effort and knowing us and the way you all have, Catrice, have managed to spread this out on Facebook, on social media. Right. It's, a, it, it, it's, it, it's amazing. And we will have this accomplished. And will we continue doing this for next year, Catrice? Oh, most definitely. This is only the start. <laughs> And let me, uh, let me ask you about last night. I hate I missed it last night, but it was, from what I heard, it was a bomb. 
Tell me about it. We had a blast. Uh, last night was the first annual mixer. Uh, we had all classes there. Everybody's in there enjoying itself. Matter of fact, I even stopped the music and made people fellowship, get to know each other. Like, we're family. I don't care where you're from. If you went to Yates, you family. I don't care what, great, what year you graduated. We family. As he said, this did start on Elgin. But we're trying to put aside all the animosity. Uh, yeah, a lot of people from... Uh, um, Madison, Willow Ridge, that, that Jones, all they, all they found. Remember, when the slaves came here, we had third ward, fifth ward, and fourth ward. Right. It's nice to see us branch out and do something in Houston, knowing that we, along with Booger T. Washington, was the first two black high schools right. in Houston. So we're just branching out. We don't care what school you came from, even though it's a Yates alumni mixer coming.